Bravo pH monitoring system is a catheter-free way to measure the amount of acid your esophagus is exposed to over a period of time. Under sedation, we do a standard endoscopic exam to look at your esophagus, stomach, and first part of the small intestine. Afterwards, through the endoscope, we attach a pH capsule about the size of a gel cap to the wall of the lower esophagus. This pH capsule will then wirelessly transmit information on acid exposure to a small recorder that you will wear for the duration of the test. The duration of the test can be for either 48 hours or 96 hours. This capsule will usually fall off on its own after five days, will pass in your stool and does not need to be retrieved. The purpose of the Bravo pH study is to answer the question of whether you have acid reflux or not, and potentially whether you're responding to your current therapy for acid reflux. Answering these questions will help guide the management of your symptoms. Indications for testing includes suspicion for gastroesophageal reflux disease or reflux symptoms not improving or resolved with acid suppressing therapy. Reflux symptoms can include heartburn, regurgitation, difficulty swallowing, sensation of lump in throat, chronic cough, laryngitis, or new or worsening asthma. Remind your doctor if you are on a blood thinner, have a pacemaker or defibrillator, or have a nickel allergy. If you are undergoing the Bravo pH study off acid suppression for the entire study, or for the first 48 hours of the study, you should stop your proton pump inhibitor seven days before the procedure. You should stop your H2 blocker two days before the procedure. And you should stop all other antacids one day before the procedure. If you do not have to be off acid suppression for any part of the study, then you may continue your acid reflux medications unless otherwise instructed by your physician. You cannot eat or drink anything after midnight the night before the procedure, except for small sips of water with any necessary medications up until four hours before the procedure. You then have to be strict nothing by mouth starting four hours before the procedure. On the day of the procedure, you will get individualized instructions for what to do with your acid reflux medications for the duration of the study.